Everyone's gonna be like, what? Another one? <laughs> yeah, they're gonna hear the explosion and freak out. There's no achievement this time. <gasps> oh, did he get out? How did he get out? I don't know, but he's going up. Oh my god. Guys, I have brand new merch available on my merch store. The link is in the description below, so make sure to grab it while you can before we change it out. Hi guys, and welcome back to the next episode of X Life. So last episode, we decorated our house and it looks very, very cute. I love it. And as you can tell in the kitchen, we also added a mod that lets us place down items. So that's why there is now a loaf of bread and the mutton is on top of the smoker rather than in an item frame. So we are also going to continue making our area pretty today. I have a few things in mind that I need to get done and such, but I'm gonna start by going and building myself a barn, a proper barn for all the animals so that I can kind of clear up that space because the pens are just kind of taking up way more space than they need to right now. So we're going to hop into that time lapse. <laughs> Okay, so since the time lapse, some other things have also changed. I have been busy. So if you come outside now, you will notice we have this lovely path and also these super cute walls. I love them. So this all started because on stream, I was doing the path here and Fwip came over and offered his services to build me a custom tree, which is this one. So he built this and I put in the lanterns and the apples and put in the apple crate and such, and it was all looking super cute, but I wanted to put some sort of walls on some areas of the path and I asked Flip for some help on what to do and this was what he sort of suggested was using the slate. So I went in and done all of these. It looks super cute. Now you may be wondering where the trees are here as well and that's actually gone because Flip is going to build me a few more big oak trees like that and then some other like aspen things in between it and that's what this chest here is full of leaves for is Flip is going to work his magic around that. Now another thing we also have up here is another ring and this little green one hides something fun. Well kind of fun, kind of cool. And this is my automatic sheep farm. So I am going to set up automatic sheep shearing farms for all of my sheep colours of all the wools and I will probably set up a shop somewhere selling them. But for now I have these four colours and I will probably do a lot of this just over time over on streams. Twitch.tv slash smajor1995. Link is in the description below so come and hang out. I stream over there quite a lot. And that will then be an area that I can just AFK in at times, fill up the shop and then hopefully make some money. I also have my villager trading hall which is a lot longer now. I basically have everything I need or I think I do. So it's coming along well. I also I'm really happy with how the barn has come out. I think it's super cute. I really like the design. It was just something I sort of came up with in a creative world and then just idea that I could replicate it here and I think moving it to this side gives me so much more space because I have all of this space to put in other buildings as well and I will probably bring this path wrapping around and maybe coming down here as well so that you can go up from either side. I need to do a lot of shuffling about like I need to move this sugar cane at some point, I need to move that sugar cane at some point. There's just a lot of things that constantly need done but one thing I'm also going to do today with Flip who I've been mentioning a lot is we're going to go in there. We're going to properly explore the nether. It's been long awaited but it needs to be done. I'm pretty confident now because I have good fire protection gear and my hell infusion on my sword 
which means that it does more damage. So I'm hoping that will work. Also, we did some upgrades down here and we put Leopold into his own little aquarium because he's a murderer and doesn't play nice. And then we have Nessie 2.0 and there's another little fishy in here somewhere. There she is, that's Angela. Angela the angelfish and Nessie 2.0. She's living her best lives. Also, if you're an eagle-eyed viewer, you may notice that my hearts are actually blue. And that is because what we have done is we have assigned a color to each heart amount and Lizzie made a texture pack for the members to use if they want, where basically for each time I lose a heart or rather lose a life and gain a heart, I will change it to be a different color. So like one one heart is red, two hearts are blue, three hearts are green, four hearts are orange, things like that. So that is what we're going to be having progress through the series, but I think it's a really cute addition. And the little blue hearts look adorable. You ready to go to the nether? Yeah, I mean, we will uh, We'll find out here. I like my orange hearts and yeah. I kind of want to keep them. Yeah, I so... like my blue hearts. I've got some things, I'm ready. I've got some lassos to grab some things. I've got my totem of undying, I have some apples. Oh, I'm, I'm jealous of the totem of undying. <laughs> <laughs> the only thing is, like, I feel like my shield is more valuable to hold, so... Yeah, so you have to, you'll be like, okay, I'm dying here. I need yeah, to Yeah, so I'll just this. swap to that, like... But <laughs> hopefully we'll be fine. The goal is just get yeah. in there. I want some blaze. Maybe if we grab the blaze spawner... And soul sand, but that that's easy to grab later. Well, you'd be surprised. Soul sand is quite far away from the portal what I found when oh. I went in last time. And our portals link up, so where's yours? Yeah, I really don't know. We are probably a thousand blocks apart right here, and somehow we link up in the same nether portal i <laughs> well i have a very great entrance to my nether portal right now it's um okay it's down in my mind <laughs> i love it i love all the noise you have going on it's yeah great. it's a lot quieter than it was yesterday so i'm really thankful for it but yeah we can just jump on in here and this will be fun i'm yep. scared mm -hmm. i'm always scared i hate the geysers i hate them the geysers are so loud they're yeah. so terrifyingly loud well i know there's a portal not a portal a fortress like here and i know there are some blaze we need at least four blaze rods before we get out of here that is a must oh, yeah. oh there oh i'm on fire how are you on fire i was hoping that we'd be able to just come in find this fortress and it'd be a nice quick trip but the issue is is joel's also the type of person that would just take all the nether rack oh no wait i've lied there's nether rack here no nether rack nether war oh sweet i'm just gonna replant it because i'm not satan there's so much soul sand down there. Look at all of that. Okay, I feel cheated. I went on an adventure to find my soul sand. Oh, wait, there's a magma crew. I want to. Oh, careful, careful, careful. I hate you in that carpet. <laughs> I hate you in that carpet. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, they're a little awkward to fly the carpets. They're fine in big open spaces, but I'm worried that... Oh, well, he must be over there. There he is. Jumping to go for him. If you want to lasso him, that would be pretty great to have a lot of gas tears. I got it. Nailed it. Ha ha. I feel like Indiana Jones. I found a spawner. Found a spawner. I don't know where you are. It's literally right above you. Okay, wait a minute. Do I break it or do I kill some blazes? Maybe we kill some blazes and then we use a self touch. This is good. This is very good news. Hit me. Hi. Do you like one shot it with the hell infusion enchant? I do. Oh, that's perfect. This, that was the only reason I brought it was like, I put this on was so that I was like, well, I'm in the nether. I should be able to one shot things. That was so <laughs> handy being able to one shot blazes. So we've now done everything we needed. Now I just kind of want to explore. Oh, I forgot to put one in a lasso. I'm so dumb. I'm putting it back down for a second. <laughs> I found a big thing of basalt that looks like a face. Oh God. There's just two eyes out of quartz. And then there's a little face cut into it with like a little bit of netherite. I have two weather skeleton skulls. Oh my God. We're on our way to killing the weather. Are we doing that today? No. We can do it pretty easy. I, I actually, I have an idea on how we can make that happen. I say we go for it. You say we kill the weather today? Oh yeah. Oh God. God. I'm on two hearts. It, it's fine. We'll trap him in a block and he can't move. I trust you, Flip. If I lose my heart, I blame you. My fans will come <laughs> for you. I found you another part of this place that didn't exist. <gasps> I got a file of animation, which means I can make a new fancy colored carpet that's not blue. Oh <laughs> I am the carpet man. <laughs> Fear me. <laughs> I hate how th that's almost like worse when you have two skeleton skulls because now you're like, well, now I need to stay and get the third one. Yeah, it's like, come on now. And then that's when they stop spawning. If it had just been like one, oh wait, I found some. Theoretically, you should always be able to drop your head because you have a head. I should be able to pull it off of your corpse. Oh, I got one. What? 
I have three. Jeez. Okay. Well, there we go. We're uh we're done we can with. Kill the uh, we can kill the wither. That'd be great. Do you want to go home? I I think we I think we go home. Okay, let's go home. You want to what I do you have though, Scott? Oh my goodness! My I can see it. It's so yellow and bright. I want to. It's see so good. Okay, you ready for oh, the moment of truth? This is what we tried. Oh look how many. Oh there. look how fast that is. And this one has a 66% chance to only take one durability. Okay, I'm excited to see what we're gonna get. I'm just looking in the chest like what are we gonna get? What are we gonna get? What is it? 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 It's gonna be bones. It will be. It'll be bones or coal. Bones. Bones. <laughs> okay, I think we need to just leave him in there at the moment. Let's leave yeah, let's and leave And we'll him come in here. back to it. Thing. Yeah. We'll see if he does. Cause I feel like I've had it before where like I put a cow in it and I don't always get leather. I sometimes just get steak. We need your head. We got Head. Yes! Oh my we can do it! We can oh, do it. We're, Scott, oh, we're both gonna fly. We're gonna fly normally. Gonna fly. <laughs> Let's go and kill this guy. You know, I thought we were just going to the nether just for a fun adventure to see what was there yeah, and then we're know, coming yeah, out I with... Yeah, this was gonna be like so easy. And never coming out with like rings of flight, like... That's insane. Oh, we want it. We want this to be one wide because it tricks him into not chasing us. Oh, uh, okay. And then you just like, sl he like doesn't run at you, but he will like follow, if that makes sense. Okay, so like that. So like this makes it so we can literally just walk backwards and shoot him with a bow. Okay, I'm gonna do it. Oh, oh God, all right. <laughs> <laughs> Killing a wither on two hearts and four hearts. Okay, we're ready. Oh, no, Three. it's not. <laughs> 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 Is it gonna work? Uh, yes! Oh, it worked! He's stuck! I did it! My design worked! All right, I got him to halfway, you get him the rest way, right? Oh God, I'm so scared. Of, we've left, we've <laughs> timed the entity wipe to not. <gasps> we did it! Okay, I got my ring of flight, have fun. Ah, you, you don't have any <laughs> other part of the ring of flight, thank you very much. I have all the materials. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> okay, this is sick. I've done so much stuff, God. Look at you Look go. At I'm so proud. I can show you the world. No, that's my song. That's the carpet. That's, you've got to, you've got to pick a different song. That's the carpet song. I'll let you do the shooting again. I try, your bow's slightly better, so you do it quicker. Everyone's gonna be like, what? Another one? <laughs> yeah, they're gonna hear the explosion and freak out. There's no achievement this time. <gasps> oh, did he get out? How did he get out? I don't know, but he's going up. Oh my god. You're gonna have to fly off and hit him. I can still hit him. I think some of the glass broke. Oh. <laughs> okay. No, none of the glass broke. Somehow he like glitched into it and then when he he like came back down because nothing's broken up here. Yeah, he just broke the blocks on the top. Weird. Oh wait, I've Not got me. to put the, the nether star in here as well. There you go. You need that. That would help to <laughs> the that, key I was like, part. Oh, man, we're making a discount flight ring here this time. Okay. There <laughs> you go. Oh, oh yes. my gosh, I love it. Let's go show off to people. Joel, 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 come back. Joel, come here. Joel. Oh, he's noticed. Okay, do we fly? On three, two, two one. one. <laughs> <laughs> he's just like, what? Okay, this was a this has been a good good trip. The most successful and productive nether trip I think I've ever had in any CBs ever. <laughs> so it is actually the day after of all of that stuff that you've seen. And there has been an update. Some things have changed and some rules have been made. Basically, as a server, we decided that the Ring of Flight was too overpowered, actually, and it has been taken away. They've been turned off. You can no longer make a Ring of Flight. It's no longer there, it's gone. So we just got our nether stars back and the stuff that we pinned to it but the ring is gone. So it was the forbidden ring, lasted three hours. We had fun. But if you come down here, there's some other things that have been done and Fwip has done the trees for my little spawn area. Super adorable. I love them. They're so cute. I went in and added some lanterns to them and such, but this is adorable. And then if we go up here, you can see I put on my beacon. I don't know why, I just did. And now I have a little nether room where my nether portal is. It's super cute. So we also today, need to go and see what the submissions for the carpet auction are. So we need to head to spawn and see what we've got, see what people have been putting in. But I want to make a broomstick first. I've decided that I want to use my file of animation on a broomstick. I think a broomstick is a fun thing and I would like one. So I just need some lapis, some string and some wood. So I need some lapis, some string and a piece of wood and we pop the wood there. String, lapis, 
lapis, some wheat, and the holy grail, the file of animation, Bim, there she is, the enchanted brim, and of course, like everything I own, we are going to make it cyan. I just pop that in there with the cyan, and bam, it's now a cyan brim. It looks so shiny. So now I want to see what I look like when I'm on this. Oh my goodness. Ah, it works the same as the carpet. A cinnabite defying gravity. A cinnabite And nobody in all of X life, no wizard that there is or was, is ever gonna bring me down. You knew it was gonna happen. We sang a whole new world whenever I was on the carpets. Okay, so let's see what the magic carpet auction has. Oh, there's Jimmy. Freaking Jimmy. The worst. Anyway, so I'm gonna see back here. We'll see how many auctions we have. Oh, there's two. Jimmy is offering 64 diamonds and Fub is offering 24 diamonds. Well, I did say the top two, which means if there's only two, they both win. So they both get a carpet and I get over a stack of diamonds. I'll take it. it. Wasn't that hard. I now need to just like dismantle this so that people don't keep like doing it. I will ask them both what color carpet they want, find out that and do that for the next episode. I will deliver them both at their carpets. But that's pretty good. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this episode of Egg Slave. It was a big one. We managed to go to the nether rather successfully. We've got all the stuff we can need from the nether. Hopefully we won't need to go back there for a while. We also managed to get a forbidden ring, which was then taken away from us, but it was nice while it lasted. It's a fun little thing that me and Fout were the only people on the server to ever have one. That's fun. We also did our carpet auction and I now need to give the two winners their prizes. But if you enjoyed it remember to leave a like, comment down below, subscribe if you're new to the channel, hit that notification bell so you do not miss a video and I will see you all next time. Bye!